hello everyone in this video tutorial I am going to make a graphic video for my youtube channel ascent stories so first of all I want to say that I have first drawn a picture of sky and a then I imported that picture into my 3D graphics suite Blender 2.79B. Then I just from the engine I used the cycle engine, cycle render engine. So and then I just switch to the world tab and used nodes as background and then I imported environment texture and I just took the picture I drawn with GIMP uh, image manipulation program so uh, I just going to yes this is the picture first I have taken uh, first I have drawn and then I have imported that picture uh, as an environment texture map and then I created object in blender and then uh, I applied the shadow catcher shadow catcher so I am going through this video please follow along to understand now while I am keeping my shader view from solid to rendered uh, as you can see the default cycle render engine is previewing uh, the image rendered image so as I uh, am getting the result so I am satisfied with this result so then only I set the uh, other settings like uh, like camera I have adjusted a few step uh, like in the camera property I have uh, the focal length I have set 27.29 something like that okay not accurately so I can adjust uh, the focal length to get the right result so and then I uh, just fix it to uh, this value uh, let me undo few step as I change in this 27.29 approximately to get the result then I rendered uh, by pressing the F12 key on my keyboard uh, and just got the picture so the main thing is uh, I have changed this uh, cube material uh, so I am going to select cube and then the material tab 
then as i can see i took the uh, glass bsdf surface material and i also applied the noise texture i applied the noise texture to get uh, noise on my cube cube object and then uh, the default setting i kept the io default setting i kept as as it is and uh, then i done the plane plane and then i set the material to diffuse bsdf uh, a surface material and um, but in the object property i just checked on this shadow catcher so that uh, uh, when i i i am taking the rendered image that time this plane will not see on my rendered image so that's why i checked on the shadow catcher <coughs> as this is also working on this render shader as i'm switching off the plane is showing and uh, that's why without uh, taking the picture of the plane i i am able to um, take only the shadow uh, catch only the shadow of my plane so that and the lamp is also i have adjusted from point lamp to sun point lamp to sun and uh, and uh, the other setting is i kept default and as the cast shadow is checked on and multiple importance is checked on automatically the i have not done anything with the settings and took this picture now uh, in this way i have completed my world environment background with cycle render uh, from uh, drawing image in gimp and uh, doing uh, by using the cycle render engine available in blender 2.79 and the result i found finally is without using the cycle render engine image and under this image i kept the rendered with cycle so this is the final thing i am zooming out a little bit so the entire picture will be available okay so this is the thing and ha this is without using cycle and this is the output of cycle render running the image sizes by default when i rendered is one thousand nine hundred twenty by one thousand eight hundred eighty so this is all about this tutorial hope uh, this video will uh, give you a little bit tips and thank you for watching my video